In the sequential segmental approach to diagnosing congenital heart disease, the morphological arrangement of the atria is the starting point. Situs is a term used to describe the position of the cardiac atria and viscera. There is a close relationship between the arrangement of the atria and the position of the descending aorta in the great veins at the level of the diaphragm. There are four possible types of viscera and atrial arrangement, usual, mirror image, and left and right isomerism. Today, we are looking at a cranial caudal write up presentation. Step 1. First, with your transducer, identify the fetal head, then rotate it 10 to 90 degrees to get the fetal neck position. Next, you sweep it downwards from the fetal neck along the spine to obtain a clear kernel view. Please be aware that the fetal head is on the left side of the observer on the video screen. Step 2. Since it's a vertex presentation, you need to rotate the transducer 90 degree clockwise to obtain the transverse view. Step 3. We will be taking a look at the left hand rules of thumb, adapted by Bronston. The wrist as the fetal head, the palm as the fetal abdomen, dorsal side of the forearm as the fetal back, fingers equal to the fetal feet. Also, please note that the thumb will always point to the fetal left side. Put your left hand on the same position as the fetal body. Reminder, since this is a vertex presentation, the wrist, which is the fetal head, will be inferior. In this example, the fetal spine is at the left of the screen, so your hand dorsal will be facing the left of the observer. Step 4. With the transverse view, you need to create a straight line from the spine that divided the fetal body into half, then apply the technique. You will notice the thumb and heart are positioned as listed below. Which leads us to the conclusion that the fetal heart is on the left side of the fetal chest. Thank you for watching our video. If you like the video, please subscribe to our channel and for more content like this in the future.